568 pounds, here is King Mabel. His opponent, soon to be making his way to the ring area, wrestling out of Indianapolis, Indiana, weighing 229 pounds, Flash Flanagan. One fall or to the expiration of our time. Not a lot of time remaining. We're gonna to try to get Jerry the King Lawler out here and uh, ask him the burning question in the USWA. Uh, if he and Brian Christopher are related, we're going to try to get that on right now. Flash Flanagan in a return match. You saw what happened last week with Flanagan and Mabel. Mabel sitting down on the job and Flanagan going right to work on him. Two. He almost got him. Count of two was all he got. Flanagan going right after Mabel. I tell you, didn't even give time for the bell to ring. Flash trying to get the first blow in on this big man and the 500 pound plus Mabel, King Mabel if you would, now taking the fight right to Flash Flanagan. Now fans, we're running short on time. We want to try to get an answer to the question. We've been, uh, it's been a burning question on everybody's mind throughout professional wrestling. And I was told that we would get an answer today from Jerry the King Lawler. So we're expecting the King out here momentarily. Here's Flanagan sent to the turnbuckle, Big Mabel. Just sitting, if you would, from pillar to post, Flash Flanagan being manhandled by the big man. Mabel picks him up over his head. A big press on Flash Flanagan, just dead weight, and now just slams him into the ring. That's what's gonna happen to each and every one of his opponents. You watch what I tell you, the new king of the ring. King Mabel, at the words of Reggie B. Fine, King Mabel is going to work on Flash Flanagan here in this match, picks him up to slam him again. Gonna press him one more time. Boy, this has got to take a ton out. Oh, look at this. Flanagan, a little backslide now, going to work on Mabel. Standing drop kick, staggers the big man. Flanagan, off the rope. Oh, oh what a move. Did you see that move, man? Did you see that? Couldn't miss that one. 500 pounds in the air of King Mabel across the jaw of Flash Flanagan. We are running out of time. We've only got about 30 seconds or so remaining. And Flash Flanagan sent into the turnbuckles by Mabel. We're still waiting for the King, Jerry Lawler, to come out here and hopefully be able to talk to him and get an answer to the question that's been on everybody's mind. He said he would be out. Look out, here comes PG-13, and they're going after Flash Flanagan. PG-13 after Flash Flanagan. Where are they coming from? These guys are back in the USWA with a vengeance, and he nailed him with that hubcap. This match is over. Mabel's out of the ring. Flash Flanagan being beaten to a pulp in the ring by PG-13. As Big Mabel had things going his way, and then That's out of right. nowhere came Get these two guys. Get him, Wolfie! Get him! Destroy him! Nashville, Tennessee, tonight, live USWA wrestling action returns to the Nashville Fairgrounds and Sports Arena. 8 p.m. is bell time, and there will be loads of action, including a main event. The Extreme Death Match falls count anywhere in the building. The match continues until one man cannot answer the bell when too sexy Brian Christopher takes on the sweet music man Billy Joe Travis with Luther Biggs in his corner. A special challenge match when the massive doomsday takes on the Spellbinder. Tag team action, Dirty Dutch Mantel and the movie star Mike Samples takes on Flash Flanagan and Nick Dinsmore. The Midgets will be in Nashville tonight when Chief Lone Eagle takes on Little Farmer John. Stephen Dunn goes one-on-one -on -one with P.J. Walker and the opening action tonight in Nashville will feature Paul Diamond taking on Bulldog Reigns. It all happens tonight at the Nashville Sports Arena. Also want to tell you Springfield and Lebanon wrestling fans, get ready because USWA Championship Wrestling will be heading your way in the near future. But all the eyes in Nashville are focused on tonight at the Fairgrounds and Sports Arena. The live USWA action kicking off at 8 p.m. Hi, I'm Buddy Good, sales manager with Advantage Dodge here in Murfreesboro. We are Middle Tennessee's number one volume Dodge dealer and a five-star dealership for three consecutive years. We worry about people after the sale. Our service department is three years running five-star, which means great service, great people, easy to work with. Of course, 3.9 on the sales side doesn't hurt either. So if you got the best price, best payment, best service, you're talking Advantage Dodge right here in the borough, Murfreesboro. 
Cruise fans, this is Randall Hall again for John Andretti's Barbecue Ribs and Grill. If you think it's hot on the track, you should see what we're cooking in the kitchen. Hickory smoked meats with sauces and spices that create a taste tuned to perfection. Take the green and hurry over to Andretti's where every meal takes you to the winner's circle. For a quick pit stop with great food and family excitement, it's Andretti's Barbecue Ribs and Grill in Music Valley next to Factory Outlet Stores and our newest location at Rivergate in the Home Depot Shopping Center. They want to know what is the relationship between you and Brian Please. Chris